Dear international students, welcome back to Full Scholarships. We are going to discuss top paid scholarship in Doha, Qatar, UAE. And this opportunity is fully funded for graduate studies and it is provided by Doha Institute of Graduate Studies. It's for the session 2022-2023. Before we discuss further about this opportunity, we will brief about this and we'll show you how to apply to this particular opportunity. We'll fill complete application process from registration to successful submission of this opportunity. But before that, if you are new and watching this video, please do like this video and do subscribe our channel. Also, if you have not followed us on Instagram, link is in the video description. Go to our Instagram page and follow. Also, you can ask us any question, any doubt, you can message us anytime. We'll answer your questions. To get the opportunity link that we have posted here for Doha UAE, you can get the link from video description below. Check the video description. There is a link on the top. Click on that link. It will redirect you to our website here. Also, you can do the same process on Instagram. By here, you can see the link. You can click on that or Instagram story. You can swipe up and it will be redirected to our website here. Here you can read details about our posted opportunities. So here you can see the uh, countries Doha UAE and it's in the Qatar similarly you can check the university Doha University of Graduate Studies its world ranking is under the 200 so eligible countries all the nationalities can apply the financial coverage is fully funded and the most deadline is 20th of January 2022 so you have enough time to apply so here are the scholarship types available so here is the Sanad scholarship for international students and here is the Tamim scholarship for local students so let me remind you once you apply to this opportunity and they check that you have submitted correct documents the international team from doha institute of qatar will submit your application to this scholarship division automatically you don't need to submit separately this scholarship application at the moment you submit this you have to fill this scholarship application but later on so after you get the email from the university that your documents are successfully submitted and your application is correct and it will be processed further, they will send you a link to fill the scholarship application. Now here you can see the available schools where you can study and here is the eligibility criteria and required document. Similarly, you can check deadline is 20th of January. I'm reminding you again and here is the how to apply section. Simply create an application portal create an account on the application portal you have to apply online submit all documents online and fill application completely online so to begin with the process of application here you can see the red button click here to apply now simply click on this here also if you have just landed on the website and do not know how to fill application you can see here video watch video to fill application simply click on this click here to apply now after clicking on it will redirect you to here Doha Institute of for Graduate Studies the official website portal here you can see the admissions section here you can check requirements GPA scholarship tuition fees and similarly here you can see the apply button simply click on this apply button here after clicking on that apply button here you can check the deadline for this 20th January and the application has yesterday begin yesterday so you can apply easily you have very high chances here are the steps and here are the required documents simply scrolling a little bit down here you can see access to online admission application click on this at the access to online admission application after clicking on that here you can see the registration page if you have previously made your login id you can use the same and sign in but as we are new simply click on this register button here after clicking on that register button here you can see submit your first name first name last name your email id and submit confirm button after confirming that it will send you an email id and you have you will get the email and password in that so let me check my email and password here you can see i have typed my you will get the password in your email and email too simply then click on sign in here you can see we have no applications yet so simply you can select here create new application click on that here you can check details and then simply start your application click on this button 
now choose the school select level of study then select program choose according to yours then click on submit here you can see the instructions you have to complete these 11 steps here mentioned on the top now have you previously applied no would you be considered for DA merit scholarship yes are you pursuing under another scholarship no no we have no employer here are you planning to use personal funding no do you add, intend to apply for DI student housing say yes so how did you hear about this say social media then simply click next now here is the second page submit the these characters choose your country and choose martial status simply choose gender and your date of birth now choose passport status country of permanent residence then national id number please do not copy paste any detail mentioned in this as these are not verified details now upload attach the pdf file i'll upload later so i'll this is not the verified detail this is just show you now simply click next so you can attach the id or here so let me attach my id after adding id simply click next here you can see third page now submit your primary phone then your address do you have a cutter address no do if you have address so we don't have then click next it will go to page 4 simply are you employed no so employment history 0 so we have to add a CV after adding CV click next now to page 5 submit your previous undergraduate qualification Select the year you attended college from. Have you already graduated? Yes. Select the graduation date. Your GPA. Attach the qualification. After attaching, click next. So we need to attach the Mars card also. Now, after attaching both documents, click on next. Here you can see page 6. Now, did you pursue a graduate degree in past? No, I didn't. So, click next. 
page 7 so do you have the was english the main language and yes i had so i can attach my transcript here similarly have you previously taken your eyelids i had not then simply click on next now page 8 i have to upload personal statement let me attach my personal statement upload here click add now upload the attachment after attaching the personal statement click next now to page 9 writing sample after attaching that click on next now submit your referee details your previous professor Just submit the correct details. I am just submitting the now submit the second. Now click yes and then click next. Okay, so current institution. Click next. So at the end, click yes, I agree, and then click on this submit button. So here you can see application has been submitted. So you can send a reminder to referee and here you can view your previous application. I hope you have understood the process. And once your application is under uh, the steps, next steps you will be asked to submit the this application for if required for scholarship. Otherwise we have mentioned here so we have mentioned would you like to be considered so you have already mentioned that i need scholarship i have no funding opportunity i cannot use my personal funds so here comes the both applications at the same instance if required they may ask that you need to submit scholarship application separately but currently we have no requirement to submit that separately we have completed it here i hope you have understood the process and learn everything Please do like this video and subscribe to our channel. Please also follow us on Instagram and ask any questions. Please comment down the below video if you have any doubt. I hope you understood the process. Thank you for watching. Please do subscribe, like this video.